A story going viral in Marion, Indiana, celebrates the kindness of a family business owner who looks out for his customers. So this is about a wallet that was left behind for a year at a nail salon. Mm. But that wallet now back in the hands of a young lady who also has a fresh manicure and pedicure to go with her wallet. Today, our Rich and I went to that salon where the owner nailed it. <laughs> nice. When it comes to customer service. Well played. <laughs> High Wynn has satisfied customers with manicures and pedicures at his family nail salon in Marion for over 20 years. I take care of my customer. I love them like I love myself. If you do something, I do something, I just focus on the money, I never do good. Yeah, I want to take care of my customer by my heart. Kayla Euler experienced that customer service when she came into Red Nails Monday for a pedicure. High has done her nails since she was 11 years old, but her last visit was a year ago, and she left behind this wallet with no identification. There's no way he could contact me, so he really had just had to look for me or my mom, you know, somewhere around the community to see if we could walk in here so he can give it back to me. And I was just so heartfelt and moved that somebody that kind could do that for me. Kayla did not even know she left the wallet there, but High remembered. At first I was like, I don't think that that's my wallet because I haven't seen it for a long time. But before I left, I was like, can I have another look at it? And he showed it to me and I was like, yeah, that's my wallet. The wallet contained $20 and some change and gift cards. Kayla brought high a cake to say thank you and to have her fingernails done. The thing I did for Kayla, it's the same I did for everybody. Too many people, they came here, they forgot something. And the couple hour and couple days, they come back to, to get it back. But Kayla didn't come back for a year and didn't know her wallet was waiting. He has an unbelievable amount of integrity and honesty. I'm going to keep this wallet, I hope, and never lose it again. I really would like to like share this to people in the future, just know this story about how kind people are in the world. High immigrated from Vietnam in 1993. Red Nails has received the Best Nail Salon Award in Marion several ye recent years. And obviously he remembers his customers, right? He told me today that he did Julia Moffitt, our WTHR Sunrise anchor. He did her nails back when she worked in Fort Wayne. Oh, back in the no. day. <laughs> yes, and you know what? That's right. She commuted, so she lived in that Marion area right. there. So, oh, my and goodness. So Julia story. High says hi. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Red Nails in Marion. You got it. Yeah, let's give them some business. Great All right. Great story. Thanks, Rich. All right.